Hello and welcome to Adam and Craig Do Stuff where today we're doing a Lantern Festival at West Midland Safari Park. So, regular viewers will know already that we absolutely love this place. Um, and we haven't done, well, I don't know, have they done lanterns before here? I don't know, if I'm honest, I can't remember if they I did it last year. I am not actually sure. I do have a feeling it is the first time, to be fair. If they haven't ever done it before, then we've ne if they have done it before, then we've never been. Uh, yeah. There's one already here, look. Wait, uh, not showing well on camera because I haven't got it set up right, but um, yeah, there's already a few as you drive in. Is Cinderella, is that what that is? Um, Oh, it might be. Yeah, it's someone in a, in a it's someone in a carriage. But yeah. um, already, it's absolutely crazy busy. Oh gosh, it is. Um, yeah. I would definitely, if you're gonna come, I would definitely make sure you you come a lot, a, like half an hour before your slot because yeah. it's just mad. The the queue to get in was crazy, and it all the crazy. queues, all the traffic around Beaudley was absolutely mad as well because of it. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a busy one. Uh, people are probably gonna get in the way of our footage, but hey ho. <laughs> This is what we live for. Um, but this is the first uh, lantern trail we've got. We're also doing uh, Yorkshire Wildlife Park, uh, Alton Towers as well, I've got one coming. Um, and there may be another one that we sneak in there. Uh, so keep an eye on the channel for that. Um, but it'll be interesting to see how they all compare. And yeah. uh, we absolutely love West Midland Safari Park. So this is a great one to start on. This is the first time we've ever done a lantern trail as well, isn't it? Lantern trail, yes. Yeah. Light trails we've done, but this is our first lanterns. Oh, well, we did. No, we did um, that thing in Blackpool that used to be on, didn't we? Oh, yeah, but we never vlogged that. that but was years ago. No, that was way before we used to do this yeah. kind of nonsense. <laughs> Okay, so we've just, I don't even think we're halfway through yet, have we? We've just no, done the first two sections. Done, yeah, we've done Ice Age and Land of the Living Dinosaurs. Mm. Uh, which are like, actually in the, um, mm. the normal sections they're in. Um, like in the Land of the Dinosaurs, it's all dinosaur lanterns, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, the Ice Age, the, the theme is a bit more mixed, isn't it? But, yeah. Um, still, I mean, they had penguins in there, they had a Yeti, Yeti so that's still Yeti, kind of doing the thing. Yeah. Well, it was pretty big, yeah. it was pretty the biggest big one we've seen so far, isn't it? The biggest... No, that one in the car park was massive. Oh right, yeah, 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 the yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, the, the sort of biggest single. No, the um, the chariot thing that we talked about oh, right at the beginning. Right, yeah, yeah. yeah. Were you there? Yeah. <laughs> um, 
but yeah, the Yeti was was a really big one, um, and there was some fairly big dinosaurs as well. Mm. Um, yeah, quite impressive, aren't they? Really? Yeah, and it's really good as well to yeah. have it in those sections because you've still got. I mean, everything's lit up. All the trees and stuff are lit up, and the dinosaurs are still on out there. They're animatronic. Mm. I don't think the yeah. water effect was on. No, was it? it wasn't. Um, was and all of the the dinosaur noises as well are still on. So yeah. I think that that definitely sets them apart, doesn't it? The yeah. fact that they've already got that setting that really makes it. And the details impressive. of the lanterns are pretty good as well, aren't mm-hmm. they? Mm-hmm. The lanterns look fantastic. Oh, really, yeah. they look absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, we're really impressed so far. It looks it looks fantastic, doesn't it? And there's a sort of a section um, outside the Loric Heats as well that was dinosaur themed as well, yeah, wasn't there? Nice. That was really, really good. Really, really good. I'm not sure um, the other themes are for the areas, but you do get like, I did, get I, map. I did read it and I think it's like it's under I think under the sea and fantasy. Although I've been reading about Yorkshire Wildlife Park as well, so I could be mixing the two mm. up, I'm not hundred percent sure. Um, but yeah, we've still got like the whole, the rest of the, the whole rest of yeah. the park, haven't we? And I've seen the walkway down that normally leads down to the um, village. Yeah, the yeah. theme park, which um, which looks really nice. I've had a glimpse of that. It looks really fantastic. By the looks of the map, it looks like you actually go through the um, through the theme park bits as well. Yeah, well, too. you have to go past it, don't you? Yeah, oh, you mean yeah, you know, actually, yeah, the pa- the what? Oh um, yeah, because that's the this is the. Burger, you can see this dollar. I was hoping you were going to hold it so I could point at it. So, this bit here is actually through the theme park, yeah. isn't it? By the looks of it, because um, there are sort of areas um, of sort of like grass and stuff out there in between the rides, so they yeah. can probably put because they're not only put the scarecrows there for Halloween, so that's probably where they're going to put them. Um, so, yeah. Uh, if we're on it, I mean, you, you know, we're always honest on this channel, I don't like to be too negative, but there are far too many people here yeah, if we're truly it's honest it's jam-packed. so busy yeah. it's so busy in fact we've only come to sit down in the restaurant because we just wanted to get away from the crowds and we yeah. weren't even hungry yeah. um but yeah it's it's quite stressful to be honest it, it's that that's the level of people yeah, that we're dealing with in. yeah like i mean the, the ice age was just literally one big queue wasn't yeah. it you were just you were just stationary just moving one piece at a time because everybody sort of wants to stand and take selfies and get pictures and stuff which is fine which is completely understandable but at the minute there are just too many people to be doing that aren't there really mm. um, I'm hoping it's going to thin out as we sort of move through because the dinosaurs weren't quite as busy as the Ice no. Age um, but yeah there's, there's a lot of people I think here because with the dinosaurs you've got more room to spread there out there is a bit more room yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah I'm hoping it does spread out because at the minute it, it's, it is too crowded um, but the lanterns look fantastic yeah, they the do. lanterns look so absolutely bright, fantastic so, so colourful stunning Amazing. and there's some interactive bits as well yeah. I don't know we haven't come across any yet this have we the map that there is yeah um, but there are some interactive elements I mean so. in the dinosaur bit we saw a couple of moving lanterns yeah we, like, we saw one was there more than one I saw one I definitely saw one at the, the hatching yeah. and then there was another one later on of the same um, just outside the it was by the shop the dinosaur oh, okay, shop fair yeah. um, so yeah um Hopefully we'll we'll uh, we'll get some videos of that as well, the interactive bits. It'll be interesting to see what they are. Um, but the lanterns, the lanterns look fantastic. The lanterns look absolutely fantastic. But if you can, I would definitely try and book like a weekday <laughs> or something. Don't come on a Saturday. It's um, it's quite an experience.
Okay, so in what is quite a dramatic turn of events, um, it's actually completely empty now. Like it's what eight twenty past eight, something like yeah, that, something coming like up to that. half eight, um, and it's just it's just cleared out completely. There's literally there's nobody around. There's literally nobody. We've just walked through the ice age. We hardly saw anyone. There's nobody in front of us in the dinosaurs. I just heard some sort of crunch. I don't know if there's someone hit, hidden in the bushes. That's a bit weird. Um, but it's it's empty, isn't mm. it? It's absolutely lovely. So um, definitely, definitely, definitely book the, the latest slot you can because it obviously is going to clear out um, a lot later on. It's like a different event to what we came to yeah. <laughs> earlier, isn't it? It's bad. Um, but yeah, it's a lot, lot nicer now. We've gone round again, which is another thing. Like you, you're not um, restricted to going round once. You can just keep going round. Um, so we're going round again. It's a lot nicer now. We can just sort of wander around and and just enjoy it, really, can't we? Mm. And it is beautiful. I mean, you can see all yeah. the colours in the trees behind really us, nice. and there's all these dinosaurs around here. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely stunning. I can't see where I'm going because this light is so bright. So. If I fall over, I do apologise. There we go, have you had fun? Yeah, it was good, yeah, yeah. Oh wow, is that it? Oh, that was a really nice little event, wasn't it? Mm, it was yeah, really it was, nice. It was really nice. Um, yeah, the lanterns look fantastic. The lanterns look absolutely fantastic. Mm. It sort of spreads across most of the the walkthrough section of the park, and it's just great as well that they've got the dinosaur bit and they've got the ice age as well. So, um, which naturally adds to the lanterns, don't they? Really? Yeah. Because you've got yeah. that natural setting. Um, and some of the animat not all of the animatronics were on, but some of the anim animatronics in the dinosaur and the ice age section were on oh, as well. Yeah, yeah those ones. Um, yeah. And the sound effects were on as well. Mm. So yeah, the really nice atmosphere um, through um, those sections. I think the dinosaur bit was my favourite bit. Yeah, actually. Yeah, it was my favourite. I think bit. it was my favourite bit. I think after the dinosaur bit, you can't really tell what the themings were. This yeah, seemed a little bit random. I th well, I thought I read that. Um, there were different themed areas, but yeah, after the dinosaurs, it was just sort of a mismatch, wasn't it? You yeah. had sort of the mushrooms and the yeah. the bugs and the pandas. The pandas oh, were a really nice pandas. little bit, and they there was a bit cute. with woodland animals as well, yeah, wasn't there? Good. I liked all the creatures. That was really nice. Yeah, yeah, all the animal ones were the well, they were the best ones, really, weren't yeah. they? The um, the animal ones, the pandas and the the woodland creatures were fantastic, and like we said, the dinosaurs and that yeti. That yeti mm. looks amazing. Mm. Um, yeah, that was that was fantastic. That was really nice. Um, definitely, definitely, definitely. I cannot stress this enough. Book a late slot because you do not want to. You do not want to come here at half past five like we did and deal with those crowds. Honestly, yeah. book a later slot. It's a lot quieter. It's so much quieter, um, and you can just sort of dawdle around and really appreciate it and and really take it in, can't you? Mm, a lot definitely. better. Uh, so yeah, book the book the latest slot you can. Really, I don't know. How, I don't actually know what time it closes, but. I would try and book the the latest slot you can because it'll be a lot quieter and you, you won't have to deal with um, all those crowds and you can just sort of appreciate it a lot more. Um, but yeah, that was fantastic. So next we are at Yorkshire Wildlife for their Lanterns Festival. Are you excited for that? Yeah, I am. Um, yeah, because we were meant to do this one last year, but uh, we couldn't because the tier system came into place. Yeah, so we couldn't travel to Yorkshire. No. Um, so we had to cancel it, didn't we? Yeah. Um, and we are also doing a daytime vlog there as well. Yes, it'll be the first time we've seen their sea lions. So really excited for that. Yeah, so we'll be able to get proper footage of mm -hmm. um, Port Lobos, Port yeah. Lobos, I don't know how you pronounce it, but um, the sea lion exhibit. Um, we'll be able to maybe have a sneak peek of what's going on. Uh, in terms of future development, I know it would be nice to back, be back at Yorkshire yeah. Wildlife Park because it's a beautiful wildlife park. Um, to subscribe to us if you want to see that, other animal content, other lanterns content, because that will be coming up this um, this winter, and of course theme park content is something we do as well. Um, give this video a like, comment down below if you've been and you've enjoyed it, let us know what your favourite part was, and we shall see you next time we do stuff. we go have you had fun yeah it was good yeah yeah oh wow is that it oh.